project was tendered out uh, late last year, probably mid-September or so, and it was the first of its kind of this size. The project price was about $7.3 million, which is a huge guardrail type job uh, anywhere in North America. Our main focus as a subcontractor is sign and guardrail work uh, along with minor grading projects. We have taken a, a company to what it is today to be able to take on the type of projects that we're undergoing on Highway 2 with the cable barrier system. Over the years, there's been a number of serious accidents where people will cross the median and drive out into oncoming traffic, uh, you know, of course, resulting in horrific accidents. So in order to provide a safety net uh, in that corridor, they decided to go with the cable barrier system. The amount of cable used in this project is equivalent to one of strands of uh, three-quarter inch cable running from Calgary to Edmonton and from Edmonton back to Calgary between Calgary and Red Deer is probably one of the busiest corridors in all of Canada. So our guys have taken the steps to make it as safe as possible for our employees and as well as the traveling public. Something new to every one of us. None of us have done anything like this before. We've manufactured a lot of the tools ourselves over the winter time. A lot of good ideas coming from frontline guys doing this stuff all the time. Uh, all these machines basically searched on the internet, found something that would probably work manufactured the head to drive these sockets in. Took some other ideas for spooling cable. comments by the engineering firm, by Calvert Transportation, that in fact it would be a miracle if, uh, if we pulled this job off in the 45 days that we said we would. And uh, I'm pretty excited about that because we're going to get to see a miracle. It's a great opportunity for us to showcase Alberta Highway Service in the province. We're working close with the consultant and the government and from what I understand, both the consultant and our client, the Alberta government, are very happy with what we're doing so far.